Hello, welcome to module one of our five part lead attractor attraction marketing boot camp. We're going to be talking about how to generate free leads for your network marketing business and get paid even when people do not join your team. Most people don't realize that 97% of the people who join a network marketing business never make a profit. That means that 97% of the people never made more money than it cost them to stay active in the business. They never make enough money to cover their monthly auto ship. But why is that? Have you ever thought about that question? Why do most people fail at network marketing? This answer is critical to your success. Because until you know why most people fail, chances are you'll find yourself literally doing the same things that are causing the majority of people to fail. Or you'll find yourself not doing what is necessary to ensure your success. Either way, you lose. So let's talk about that. Let's talk about the seven most common reasons why most honest, hardworking, sincere people never make any money in network marketing and what you need to do about that to put the odds of success in your favor. Plus, when you know the reasons why most people will continue to struggle in this business, then you can easily brand yourself as the leader people are looking for because you now can show them exactly how and why they are having challenges. Does that make sense? Okay, let's get started. Number one, most people never make any money in network marketing because they joined the wrong company for the wrong reasons, meaning they didn't approach the business from the standpoint of making an informed business decision. They got caught up in the emotional aspects of the presentation or relationship involved and joined for emotional reasons. Some of those kind of reasons that I'm talking about include get in now, it's a ground floor opportunity. Only the people at the top make all the money, so get in now. You'll get massive spillover from your upline. We'll even build your business for you. Which, as a side note, if that was true, if any company, line of sponsorship, or turnkey system really could build a business for you, why exactly would they need you anyway, right? Another emotional reason might be because the company is endorsed by a well-known actor, a doctor, or business leaders. But bottom line is, who really cares? Just because Donald Trump or Winnie the Pooh, for that matter, endorsed the company, products, and comp plan doesn't mean it will be any easier to build a business than it would be without them. Are they going to market your business for you? Of course not. Another emotional bait piece that's often used is the low cost of joining. It's only $29.95 to join and $10 per month to stay active. This means that not only does everyone need to be in, everyone can afford to be in. You'll get rich overnight. Can't you see it? Oh my gosh, you better sign up right now. Or perhaps the most dangerous of all, you sign up under your war market, a family member, a friend, or a coworker, as a favor, or out of guilt, or because of the emotional need to reciprocate somehow. So instead of taking a good, hard, honest look at the business from the standpoint of building a profitable business, signing up for emotional reasons, regardless of the reason, is one of the biggest reasons that the majority of people will never make a dime through MLM. The second reason is because the compensation plan has no room for a marketing budget, meaning the company does not pay enough in upfront commissions to make advertising and marketing your business a viable solution. So you're literally forced to use nothing but free marketing and advertising methods, which more often than not may not work or may not work fast enough to launch your business into momentum. We actually do use some free methods within my team, which is a whole nother side note. But you, for example, did you know that the average cost of getting a business opportunity lead by any number of direct marketing methods is between four and $12 per lead? 
let's crunch the numbers. So let's just say the business that you're involved with only costs $149 to join, and it pays $50 sign-up bonus when you personally sponsor a new person, which seems reasonable. So you decide to run a card deck advertising campaign, which costs about $1,200 to reach 25,000 people. Now, the average card deck response rate is about 1%. But let's triple that just for fun so you can expect 750 people to respond to your ad for a cost of about $1.60 per lead, which is really, really inexpensive. Now, the average lead to sale conversion rate is about 1.5% on the high side, but let's triple that again just for fun. So now you're looking at potentially sponsoring 22 people. Now, 22 times 50 equals 1,100 in sign-up bonuses, which is pretty good, actually, because you're only upside down and out of pocket $100. Now, if you spend $1,200 to earn $1,100, but your team actually duplicates, you're actually making out okay. But let's keep it real here and realize we totally just made up those numbers. We were playing with a lead cost of only $1.60 per lead, and in the real world, you can be lucky to produce a good lead for under $4. And at $4 a lead, the entire house of cards comes tumbling down. So take a close, hard look at your compensation plan. Is there realistically room for a marketing budget in the real world? If not, then you might be advised to find another business if you really want to make any real money. This is tragic, but true. Number three, the third reason that most people will never make money in network marketing is because they lack marketing skills. In fact, the problem with network marketing in general is when you set out to sign up new people, you're asking these new people to join a business model that requires marketing skills to make any type of real money. And the majority of these people have zero marketing experience, absolutely zero. And then we wonder why our business isn't growing. Think about it. You decide to approach your neighbor, Jim, about your opportunity because he seems like a sharp, capable, success-oriented guy. Now, Jim's been working for the phone company for the past 30 years, but he may just be interested, so you hit him up. And sure enough, he joins and immediately asks you what he's supposed to do. So what do you say? You tell him what you've been taught. Make a list of everyone you know, your family, your friends, your coworkers, old teachers and kids from your childhood. Everyone, call everybody up and sign them up. So Jim does just that. Actually, probably not, but let's just pretend that he does. So Jim calls everyone he knows and signs up his buddy Fred. So tomorrow Jim comes knocking on your door. Okay, I did that. I contacted everyone I know and I signed up Fred. Now what do I do? Now what do I do to take my business to the next level? And now what are you going to tell him? What would be your answer to the now what question? Once you've exhausted your warm market, now what? And because most people have no clue, which is all about sales and marketing, that's it. Their network marketing career stalls out. So if you're really serious about taking your business to the next level to make a profit and live a lifestyle that people only dream about, understand that you must master the art and science of marketing, plain and simple. Number four, another big reason why most people will never build a profitable network marketing business is because they have no cash flow, meaning you don't have a steady stream of income coming in to cover your expenses and to fund your marketing efforts. Because the reality is, unless you've got very lucky early on in your career and sponsor a heavy hitter, it will take a good three to five years or longer to build a nice executive residual income in most companies. That means three to five years without any extra cash flow to cover the cost of doing business. Most people don't have the extra resources to cover themselves for that long of a run. So the key is to create and market using funded proposals so that you can get paid even when people do not join your team. And we'll be talking a lot more about this in the modules ahead. And as you'll soon discover, 
there really is a way to create multiple streams of income right now so you can stay in the game long enough to create a quiet fortune. The fifth reason that prevents most people from making money in MLM is high attrition rates, which is the number of people who quit, which on average is 80 to 90% per year. So this means if you go out and sign up 100 people today, on average, 365 days from now, you'll have about 20 of these people still active on your team. This means the goal is to build your business long enough, large enough to overcome the attrition rate, which means you may have to build very big, very fast to get enough fuel to keep the fire going. Now the cause of attrition is usually having a product or service that you have to buy on auto ship to stay active that most people would not buy at that price and from that company if they were not getting paid to do so. Meaning, think of it this way. If it costs you $100 per month to stay active in your MLM and you get a 30-day supply of vitamins for that $100, ask yourself this question. If you did not have the promise of getting paid, would you spend $100 per month for vitamins from this company? If not, your business will see a high attrition rate. Because again, most, the majority of people will not ever make any money in network marketing because of all the reasons that we've already discussed. And if they're not making any money, they, and they wouldn't pay for those products at that price from that company under normal circumstances, they will quit the auto ship 80 to 90% of the time. So if you're currently in a company where you would not buy that product at that price in the normal market, again, you might want to seriously reconsider trying to build a profitable business with that company because you're looking at a very steep uphill battle with the odds definitely stacked against you. Number six, lack of leads is another big reason why most people do not enjoy the success that they're looking for because when you really break it down to the money making activities and network marketing there are only three things you really need to do to make a fortune you need to expose your products service and business opportunity to new people on a regular basis you need to guide them into a simple presentation you need to follow up and enroll them that's it simple as one two three connect direct and enroll so the million dollar question is, where are you going to get your leads? How will you find new people to present your opportunity to on a consistent basis over an extended period of time? Lead prosperity leads to prosperity, but the opposite is also true. A lack of leads results in a lack of results. Number seven, the final reason why most people will never make money in network marketing is that they do not have a marketing system in place, a tried and true proven system that is designed to generate leads on a consistent basis. Sift and sort through these leads by qualifying for interest, desire, and financial ability, present, close, and train. Because think about it, most of us already have full-time lives. We, have a, we may have a full-time job or career, full-time kids, full-time chores, and full-time responsibilities, yet we somehow need to create full-time income working part-time in our spare time, which is literally impossible unless you learn how to leverage your time and resources by utilizing a proven system. So there you go. The seven biggest reasons why most people fail to build a profitable business. The good news is by simply learning what we've learned here today, you are now greatly increased your odds of success because now you know what to do about it and why. And now that we know what not to do, it's time to find out what we should be doing because success leaves clues. Great, big, gi gigantic footprints in the snow. So in the next module, module two, we'll dig, into, we'll dig a little deeper into how to guarantee success when failure is no longer an option for you. See you on the next module. Bye for now.